COVID-19 cases in most Duval County schools are reported online through the Duval County Public Schools dashboard, but that number does not include charter schools. Now some parents say there needs to be more transparency, and one mother says her kindergartner tested positive for the virus. She talked with News 4 Jacks reporter Renee Beninati. Renee is live outside Seacoast Charter Academy. Renee, what did she tell you? Mary, I talked to Sherry Muhammad, who says her five-year-old daughter now has COVID less than two weeks after starting kindergarten here. She believes the school and the school district aren't doing enough to protect the students. Sherry Muhammad's daughter, Gabby, just started kindergarten here at the Seacoast Charter Academy on August 10th. Last Thursday, she says she learned another student in the same grade tested positive for COVID, but she was not notified by the school. Because all the kindergartens both re come out at recess together. The next day, Gabby started not feeling well. She just had a stuffy nose and a really bad cough. And then on Friday, she was complaining about ear, her ear hurting. The five-year-old tested positive for COVID-19. When I found out, I was just shocked. But the family tells me they are more shocked about how the school district is handling the pandemic. Students and staff are not required to wear masks at this charter school. And Mohammed says many don't. As her grandmother, what's your biggest concerns about what's going on at her school? I feel like they're not protecting her. I think my masks should be mandated. They should be doing testing. This, this thing is bad and it's killing people every day. Last September, we asked the district why cases at charter schools are not listed on the online dashboard. They responded saying it was because of incompatible data systems and said it was up to each individual charter school to decide whether to share that information. The family says administrators are not notifying parents about cases across Seacoast Charter Academy. What would your message be to the school district? It's out there. It's a disease out there and it's dangerous. And we don't want our child to wind up in the hospital on the ventilator. News 4 Jax did reach out to the Seacoast Charter Academy. They responded saying they are following CDC guidelines and that their principal would have to get back to me. Reporting live in Duval County, Renee Beninati, Channel 4, the local station.